Good morning everyone. It is Tuesday morning and I am uh, not, it's not, I wouldn't call it a full day of eating. Um, right now I am just uh, I'm pretty busy today so I've got dinner going in the crock pot. I'm making some um, beef spare ribs and I'm actually heating up some water to make uh, bulletproof tea. Um, I've got a yummy tea that I'm going to show you uh, what I'm doing with. Um, but let me turn my camera around. Let me show you what I'm cooking. Um, no, actually, let me... There we go. I think that'll do. I found some bacon in the fridge. So I'm actually going to put that in with the, the spare ribs. So I'm cooking these guys on high for about three hours. I'm about an hour and a half in. Um, and then I'm going to turn them down to low and let them cook for like another six hours. Because um, we're running around doing stuff today. There's one little tiny piece of bacon left. Eek! Oh, drop in the bag. There's one little tiny piece of bacon left. That one's mine. I claim it in the name of Spain. Okay. Let me actually see. So pretty. Okay. So I am now. I think. Let me see. Yep, my water started boiling. So let me get that. Find my cup. Let me see if I can't get things set up over here. Constantly in different areas of my house. All right, bear with me just a sec and I will get the, um, the cup and everything ready. Okay, so I have got um, this really yummy tea. I found it several months ago. Um, it is the Bigelow, 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 I don't, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, um, toasted coconut, I don't know, Bigelow makes me sound like Gigolo, and I'm, I'm not sure if that's, that's right, anyway, it's the toasted coconut, um, it is really good, so what I do is I make a bulletproof tea with that. Oh, of course it did, right as I was grabbing it. Tag nabbit. Yeah, of course, little taggy fell in the water. Ow, and it's hot. Ladies and gentlemen, hot water is hot. Okay, we are going to let that steep for just a few moments. Got my bullet blender. Now I have got I bought it at Sam's Club. It is organic virgin coconut oil. This is the one that smells like coconut. This is the, the unrefined, you know, still smells like coconut, coconut oil. So I'm going to do 
I just eyeball it honestly, about a tablespoon of heavy cream. spoonful of coconut oil. Now I'm one of these people, I like my drink sweet. I know it is not. Ooh, I'm about to knock my camera over. I know it's not the greatest thing to add a lot of sweetener to your stuff, but I like my drink sweet. So I'm doing two packets of Truvia. And three drops of the liquid um, sucralose. I like the liquid because there's no fillers in it. There's no maladextrin or anything like that. It's other than a couple preservatives, it's just sucralose. hot tea is still hot. The only problem with these cups is there's no like rubber holder or anything on them. Okay. That in my bullet blender. And honestly you could probably throw a scoop of protein powder or something. Now I have become paranoid about my bullet blender. Um, <laughs> I like to run them under cold water before I go and open them up. Let's just say I had an experience several weeks back <laughs> where the entire The entire thing exploded hot coffee all over me, so... I'm not quite comfortable opening the screaming hot blender of coffee. I wish I had a regular blender. I would do it in my regular blender or a stick blender. blow up in my face this time. Huzzah. Okay, so tasty. That is really good. The tea is really coconutty and then the the coconut oil just adds to that. So, um that is pretty tasty. Um, we will talk to you later. I'm gonna try and get on and do a little editing and um, we'll see. Today's busy. My daughter has therapy for her OCD. Thank goodness. And um, 
baby's finally asleep. She woke up early. Um, <laughs> she she woke up early. Mommy, mommy was not ready for that. Mommy, mommy needed a shower. So mommy said, "You can sit in the crib for a little while." Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, we are gonna talk to you later. And and if I eat anything today, I'll I'll show you what it is. But I don't want to say it's a, like a full day of eating because it's not quite. So we'll talk to you later. Bye. I've got all the meat and its fatty goodness sitting on the cooking tray. And it's out of the oven or the oven is still cooker. And yummy juices down the bottom. Um, and I'm doing some mashed cauliflower, added cheese to it after it came out. It was the this one. The bird's eye mashed cauliflower. That's pretty good. Man, it's a little bit of Franken food, but not bad. But I added cheese to it just to make it a little more cheesy together. So that'll be dinner for me tonight. My husband actually had leftovers, so me and my eldest will be eating that. It is the last vestiges of our dinner last night. The leftover in the crock pot I will fully confess I was exhausted last night and did not completely clean up after dinner so that's gonna go in the trash um, these crock pot liners are awesome I just basically pick everything up and it goes in the garbage <coughs> oh my goodness bless me um, Excuse me. Um, so yeah, that that's gonna go away.